Welcome back to another episode of Outdoor Chef Life. All right, today I'm gonna be going diving, free diving right here. Looks super kelpy. I think we're just gonna be in this protected cove area. All right, so we're all suited up. Jay provided me with a spear gun. Yep. Jay right here, he's got a YouTube channel also called Fish Dive Cook. Check him out. He's uh, from Hawaii, so he does a lot of uh, diving and he does a lot of fishing too. Definitely. Yeah. Also with Daniel right here, hey buddy. All right, we're ready. He looks pretty good. Let's hope for the best. Well, hopefully we'll get him on a real, real big link. So Taku's gonna be really stoked today if we get him one. So we'll see. We'll, <laughs> we'll see. see. Let's do this. So I think this is my fifth time total of going free diving and really excited to be out there with Jay. What is it? And right here, Jay set me up on a nice rockfish and all I had to do was pick up the gun and shoot it and as you can see right here, the fish is right in the middle of the screen and the gun's just off to the side. So I picked up the gun and I f***ed it up. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so. back down for it to check but the fish was still in its hole and Jay actually ended up getting it later on so still got the fish After that I actually went out and just started diving for some sea urchin as you can see right here. As you can see there are so many purple urchin down at the bottom and today I'm going to show you guys another amazing uni recipe so you guys can go out dive for them and make it yourself and help out with this overpopulation of purple urchin. Yeah, for sure. Oh, yeah. Nice. This was the first time I was diving around a ton of kelp. And it was actually really challenging. Because I kept feeling like I was going to get tangled up in it. Towards the end of the dive, I was actually having a difficult time clearing my ears. So it was hard for me to dive down. And I usually have a hard time cleaning my ears. I always have to plug my nose, blow, and swallow all at the same time. Um, if you have a good technique on clearing your ears, let me know in the comments. And since I was struggling, I had to call it and I uh, decided to go back in. Oh, well, I came back in. I was out there for maybe an hour and a half. Man, extra tough for me out there today because it's so kelpy. I felt like I was getting tangled up in it and very uh, mentally challenging. Uh, what'd you get? Uh, let's see. Hey, look at this bag. Some uni. I see a big old. Wow, that's a. <laughs> Looks like a kelpy yeah. right here. That's a big fish. Might be a gopher. Grassy. That's a grassy. Yeah. Nice. Laying in about 15 feet of water. That's a fat one. 
black and yellow. Laying about six feet of water. And then a mixed bag of red and purple red uni. And purple. Nice. Yeah, so it's fun. Fast stripe perch. <laughs> That's one of the biggest stripe perch I've ever seen. I was overheating like crazy. Yeah. I kept kind of punching my ass. White people with crystals in them. Oh, I think it is water right now. Never done this outside. Let's try it though. No need to measure anything. Just crack the egg in. Might be good with a single egg. The sun's pretty harsh. I'll put two eggs. Time to get down and dirty. Joe here now just gonna wrap it up got some reds some purples look at this one it's like a mix it's like a red purple this one's not not much it's okay. it's wide but it's very thin let's see let's check all of them A lot of them are very small. The dough should be ready now. It's been about 20 minutes. I'm gonna just cut up the cut up the dough. I'm gonna use this wine bottle. That's about good. I think it's thin enough. Now I'll just cut it. Nice thick cuts. So I have a bit of butter in this container and I'm just going to add maybe half the uni and make uni butter. That looks good. I have some white wine here. Add some white wine. A little bit of cream. All right, I gotta put the pasta in. Pasta only takes like maybe 90 seconds. All right, to the pan, I'm going to add the uni butter. Just add all of it. 
I know, that's, that's a lot of butter. <laughs> that's all right. It's gonna be creamy and delicious. All right. Black pepper. Here's more salt. Oh. All right, that's it. Just tearing some nori. Finish it off with the rest of the uni. <laughs> what is this? It was just coincidence, okay? Let's do it. Cheers, man. Hey, thank you guys for taking me out today. Thank you, man. Thank you for coming out here. Cheers. Yeah, cheers. Whoops. Whoa. Whoa, <laughs> got it. Save. Yeah, that pasta's got some solid, like, perfectly al dente. Mm -hmm. Got a nice bite to it. It's got a really nice sweet texture to it. Mm -hmm. from, flavor. The, from the onion. Mm -hmm. Sweet, creamy, and you can actually taste that white wine. Gives the acidity. Mm -hmm. That's all. It's pretty good. Only if we had more. Two thumbs up. <laughs> <laughs> mm. well, that uni is really sweet. Yeah, yeah. the uni is really, really good. Mm -hmm. mm. Damn, I love uni. Mm -hmm. mm. yeah, this is great. Thank you, Taku. Thanks, man. Thank you. Appreciate it. Yeah, great. man. You're welcome. Thanks for going out with us and diving with us and making us this great meal. Definitely yeah. appreciate it. My pleasure. Thank you. Nice and creamy. Good stuff. Yeah. All right. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, if you like the video, make sure to hit that thumbs up. Fish dive cook. Check them out. See you guys next time. Peace. Solid little snack, you know. Sorry I can't make more. I mean, I could. I don't really have time right now either, so. We'll have to wait for next time. Want to get some giant. Yeah.